Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Phantom Strategies. So in this video, I want to cover uh, Litecoin, Bitcoin, and Ethereum, all three of them, uh, before uh, we get into the night session and into the morning session uh, tomorrow uh, when the Asian market opens up as well. So I want to cover all three of them because we are at very critical junction right now. And... Um, I before we get into that night session I want to give you a quick update on what I'm looking at and what you should be expecting what kind of um, market um, uh, we are looking at right now and what to expect overall all right uh, so before we get started if you're new to the channel please subscribe to the channel I post new content every day uh, hit those notifications so you get this contents right away all right um, and as I said if you have any questions please uh, send it to me uh, post it in this comments below um, and I I do a pretty good job replying to them um, as soon as I can all right uh, and if you think these videos are helpful if you think you're learning something from this content uh, please give me a thumbs up uh, please share it with your friends and family that means a lot to me that really keeps me motivated in doing this video reviews and content creation for you every day okay all right so let's get into litecoin real quick uh, so litecoin we have been following the litecoin uh litecoin for a while now <clears throat> Initially, when it uh, made that dub double dip uh, back two weeks ago, I think, yeah, it, all, it was almost two weeks ago now. Um, uh, I cannot see the date below. So, yeah, it was around two weeks ago. Um, since then, we had this nice uptake. A lot of, like, you know, good news came out in the market about Litecoin. We uh, we made it all the way to 234, where we are hitting a resistance that was previous support. If you um, if you come here, this this was the previous support that uh, we saw in Litecoin, and now it's acting as a resistance. Um, so now, what what is doing right now is doing a consolidation. So if I zoom in a little bit on Litecoin, I'm looking at by the way, I'm looking at the four hour chart on Litecoin, and the data is coming from the Coinbase exchange. All right, uh, Coinbase exchange. I'm, you know what? It's it's one of those exchange been in like news for all the wrong reasons lately since December. They they need to really get their act together, otherwise they're gonna lose a lot of a lot of customers. So uh, Coinbase is one of the exchange I use it as well, but I am honestly their fees are so high. It's just it's not one of they really need to put their act together and really uh, invest in like you know proper so, uh, customer service and like support. All right, so that's we can talk about Coinbase later on. We can. Uh, um, come to that later but for litecoin uh, so right now we are in this consolidation zone uh, if you will if you see this let me just kind of like make this pretty obvious so if you look at this zone right here and i'm going to if you if you're new to the uh, if you're new to the channel or if you have been uh, following my channel you see those dotted line those dotted line the blue ones i'm going to keep them as a support so if you see this old blue line every time when i do the video review i will uh, i'll try to make it consistent so anytime when you see those blue dotted line that those are the support um uh, uh, levels and if you see those red those are the resistance now the support and resistance are based on the current trading price so right now the trading price for litecoin against usd is 222 222 and 96 cents so that means the first support that i am uh, uh, looking at is, is around 218 and then the second support is around 210 all right so those are my support areas and that's why i have those um, blue lines over there but let's say if the price action goes below um, it goes to 216 tomorrow then I'm going to make that uh, to uh, uh, the 218 uh, as a resistance and I'm going to mark it as red all right so I'm I hope I'm making clear so that's blue and red is based on where is the price trading right now okay and the red is resistance blue is support okay so i hope that's pretty simple and that's pretty clear okay so now we we know that this is the like you know consolidation zone for uh litecoin we have been seeing very positive like you know uptick in bitcoin any anything any dip that i'm seeing in uh, bitcoin is getting bought over but i'm gonna cover bitcoin in in a bit okay <laughs> so um just let's let's get out of uh, litecoin real quick so litecoin what it needs to do it needs to pick up on the volume is just consolidating right now 
I'm really uh, I really like Litecoin for 2018 it's one of those coin that is in uh, in like you know uh, media for a while now it, it's, it's it have a good team behind it and I think Litecoin has some room to grow um, grow much more and the second our the target point for Litecoin uh, the first resistance is around 234 the second one is around 260 all right so keep that in mind um, and we, we see the thing is it's, it's in this uh, like it's in this wedge pattern right now so the wedge can be bullish or bearish all right so keep keep that in mind but usually when it ha what happens is like you know it broke out a few days ago from that 160 uh, or 170 uh, price point and since then it ran all the way up to 234 and then it, it's been consolidating all right and since that consolidation what's going on with litecoin is like um it's it's just ready it's just consolidation like but this consolidation I, it can go either way it can go up it, it can go uh down but I, I it has to go like with the major uh, market momentum um so but it's, it's in that consolidation zone right now i haven't done much with litecoin i have some position in litecoin but haven't really uh, you know done much um with litecoin lately uh it, it's just like uh, it needs volume to get out of this consolidation zone. So um, you keep an eye on this thing. As I, as you can see, I have, I'm putting that wedge on this. And it, it, either way, when it breaks out, we will find out if it's breaking out with the volume, if it's if it's a false breakout or if it's a real breakout. But either way, it, it will break out soon. If I put the um, Bollinger Band, yeah, it's getting tight, tighter and tighter. Once the Bollinger Band gets tighter, it it's, it means that indicates that it's the breakout's gonna come sooner or uh, sooner. Okay, uh, I'm gonna. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna keep this consolidation zone, uh, the box here. If you wanna watch that zone from 219 to 234, that's the consolidation zone right now on Litecoin. All right, so let's look at the um, bigger picture for Litecoin. That's eight hour. Let's look at the daily. <clears throat> so on daily chart, I'm seeing um, again. It's it's a nice. It broke out of that resistance, that major uh, downtrend that we are seeing. It broke out of that, um, and you know since then it has a nice volume that came into. The, if you see those volume bars, that's a nice volume that came in uh, and went all the way up to 234. Now it's consolidating. So let's see if we can get out of that consolidation zone. Overall, I think um, Litecoin is one of the coin that I I do like to hold in my portfolio. It's it's a good coin to hold. Um, it's the transaction cost are pretty. Uh, pretty low it's a pretty fast transaction so and it's pretty widely adopted as well all right uh, and it's known as like you know silver to Bitcoin gold uh, that's that's their like you know selling point for Litecoin all right so that's pretty much it on Litecoin um, uh, let's look at the weekly real quick okay all right so weekly um, the reversal pattern that we talked about in previous video, the, we had a hammer um, last to last week, uh, which kind of gave us a signal that hey, we are turned for a reversal in Litecoin. Um, so it, it does have some leg up in the weekly. We just need to cons get out of that consolidation zone. All right. Uh, so that's pretty much it, guys, for Litecoin. I'm gonna make another video in a little bit on Bitcoin and then Ethereum. So stay tuned. Uh, let me know if you have any question on Litecoin, and we can talk about this. Um, uh, in the comment section if you have any anything else you want to ask uh, please shoot me an email and I'll be happy to help you out with that all right um, talk to you soon in a bit all right bye